Okay. <laughs> What's up, everybody? I am back with another video. And in today's video, I will be reviewing the March 2021 <laughs> curl box. And it features... It's, it's Palmer's, okay? And I don't know if you can see it. You see this right here? Biotin? Okay. Now, I don't know if y'all remember, but last year, I'll put the thumbnail right here. I reviewed a Palmer's curl box. I don't remember what month it was. But again, I'm going to put it right here and I'll link it down below. And I'm just like, they already had that. So I was very perplexed. Like, certainly, they wouldn't be putting the same collection in the box. Now, technically speaking, <laughs> it's the same. It's the same. It's the same. <laughs> This was what was in the other box. It was a shampoo, a conditioner, a leave-in, a cream, and a, a, a oil or a serum, okay? When I seen it was a biotin box, I was like, they already did that. And I was like, okay, let me go and look at what was already in the curl box to see, like, certainly they wouldn't be giving us the same thing. <laughs> This was 2019. No. Yeah. 2019. 2021. <laughs> See? Buy right here. Length retention. They both say new because this was not that long ago. <laughs> Me being who I am, you know, I got to figure out like, are y'all giving us the same thing? I reached out to, to Curlbox. I asked them, I was like, please don't take offense, but what's the difference? <laughs> and they was like, you know, this is a new line from Palmer's, catered to length retention. I was like, this was a new line. <laughs> well, it, it's all new. <laughs> so then I messaged Palmer's because if you anything like me, you want to know the difference too. So I messaged Palmer's and they got right back with me and they was like, basically the long short is they reformulated it. So... <laughs> It is the same thing, only it's been reformulated. I looked at the ingredients. Ingredients are the same, just in different, some stuff is in different spots. They wanted to develop more products in the collection and reformulate some of the products in the, um, in the collection. So that's what they call themselves doing. However, <laughs> I'm gonna say two things. I enjoyed that, that line. So if I do not enjoy this, I'm going to be upset <laughs> for one. Number two, here's the thing. I do have a gripe. If you're going to reformulate something or create something new, why reformulate and or create something new? And the first ingredient, mineral oil. Can y'all see that? <laughs> I'm not no huge ingredient person. It's only a, a few ingredients that I have issues with. The first one. <laughs> but usually when people reformulate things or create new things, they're doing it with new ingredients in mind. You made something and put mineral oil as the first ingredient? Like, I don't... So is this grease? Like, it really don't say... Melt a pea size amount between hands, then smooth onto hair and scalp, concentrating on areas most prone to dryness. What is this? <laughs> I really don't know how I'm supposed to use it. I'm going to just go for what I know. So, if you want to see my review of the new Palmer's Cocoa Butter and Biotin line and see if I prefer the other one or this one, <laughs> then just keep on watching. All right, so I'm going to start out with the length retention shampoo, the cocoa butter and biotin length retention shampoo. Ugh. Hair on me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so as you can see, it's thick. <laughs> it's not as cocoa butter. This is thick. <laughs> it's not as cocoa buttery scented as uh, the other one. I like the scent of the other one. It was definitely not this thick. <laughs> Wow. Well, it's a nice lather. Real nice lather. And it feels very moisturizing going on. Softening. 
Ooh. Man, it's a thick shampoo. <laughs> I don't think I ever had a shampoo this thick. So I just finished rinsing my hair off. Um, and my hair feels, it feels good. I just, I guess I just can't rinse my hair out completely. I'm sorry. <laughs> but my hair feels really good. It doesn't feel stripped or streaky or anything like that. If I remember correctly, I liked the previous formula too. So, so far so good. <laughs> my hair doesn't feel stripped. And to me, that's just all that matters. <laughs> So this is the length retention conditioner. It looks just like cocoa butter, the lotion. <laughs> it smells, it smells similar to the, the other collection. Um, I smell more of that cocoa butter scent. Still has more fragrance in it, but I, I definitely smell the cocoa butter in it more than I did the shampoo. And it feels pretty good going on so far. I remember that I really liked the, the conditioner from the previous formula. So, <laughs> I have high hopes for this one. I have high hopes for this, babe. Sing it, Jasmine. <laughs> and the length retention deep conditioner. This looks just like what I just used, only in a jar. Mm, smells more fragrance than just cocoa butter. Really creamy formula. Really creamy. Did I, I, I thought I took this down. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Doesn't feel as smooth going on. Maybe smooth is not the word. Feels like it applies a little bit lighter, I guess. Which is weird because it's the deep conditioner. <laughs> The length retention biotin pack. It's the pooties for me. Why do all of my products have the pooties? <laughs> it's more yellow. Don't know what that means. Has um a different scent. Is that peppermint? I'm smelling something. I don't know. This feel like I'm really applying cocoa butter. <laughs> the way it's sitting on top of my hair. <laughs> Here's the thing. <laughs> Here's the thing. This says free of mineral oil, free of parabens, phthalates, I think it's pronounced, glutens or dyes, and mineral oil. You put that, you got that plastered on all these other products, but then you got this with mineral oil as the first ingredient. I, that just really... Okay. <laughs> oh, it feels good. Feels good. Feels good. <laughs> this is the regular conditioner side. Okay. So it really only took like three passes. A couple more passes. Yeah, this takes a little bit more. But still not bad. Okay. I don't know what's in this. This biotin pack. But it's just the smell. It's not bad. You know what I'm saying? But it's just... It definitely smells completely different from the rest of the line. You can see it's more liquidy in my in my hair. More liquid in my hair. But that took less less effort though. So overall to me, the detangling or the slip all around is is good. We're just going to have to really see what happens once I rinse it out. I cannot tell a lie. Hair feels great. <laughs> All sections of my hair feel good. <laughs> I'm gonna say because in my hair, all of them feel the same. I don't 
know if there's a point in having all three. <laughs> the whole line, every product has biotin in it. And this is a biotin pack, so I guess that means it has more biotin. But the whole line is biotin. You know what I'm saying? Like it's that's the key ingredient in all of it is is biotin. So I don't know if there's a point in having all three conditioners. So yeah. <laughs> I am just going to proceed to the next step, which is using this Vitagro. Again, I don't really know how I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it like a grease, I guess. That's just the best thing I know to do. Like, look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look. Look at that. It's very much, very much grease. 2021 grease. <laughs> See what it feel like. It says scalp and pea size. I'm not putting this on my scalp. No man. No man. No man. No man. <laughs> I've been on TikTok too much, man. <laughs> I mean, it feel like what grease feel like when you put it on your hair. What you want me to say? <laughs> what you want me to say, buddy? Looks good. Shiny. As to be expected with grease. <laughs> okay, it is about two days later. Yep. <laughs> I got on the same shirt. And what about it? <laughs> These are my twists. The, um grease cream i don't know what to call it it went away i'm going to now go in with the hair and scalp oil smells good it smells really good okay i'm gonna spray some in my hand this is a nice spray you get a lot coming out which i like that so my hair doesn't have like a hard hold or a crunch or anything to it. I don't know how this is going to turn out, to be honest. <laughs> okay. That's cool. <laughs> I did them fairly small, so definition is expected. Let's see if it hangs around, you know? <laughs> okay. So there it is. <laughs> these are the finished results um i really don't know how it looks on camera overall i mean i have some frizziness um but it's more defined than i ex expected it to be <laughs> to be honest which is cool um overall i like the line in comparison to the other line um it's it, it's just it's good um uh, as far as stylers go, I'm going to say I prefer this styler as opposed to this Vitagro. I don't even know if this Vitagro is considered a styler. I'm just saying it is, you know, as far as like box completion. So, yeah. So if I had to pick and choose as far as that goes, I'm going to pick the styler from the old um, cocoa butter and biotin line. But overall, as far as shampooing and conditioning, they were both the same. I enjoyed them both. I like the oil, the last box. It came with this. I can't remember how I felt about this one, but I like how this one comes out. I like that it's a spray. I like oil sprays. It's the same to me. Either way, I, I enjoyed them both. Um, I'm glad that I did did not not like it <laughs> because I was gonna be upset. Like it was fine the first time. <laughs> so yeah, if you've tried any products from this new formulation or from this curl box. Leave your comments down below, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.